Hey guys, Amberstar here with another visual farmer, and this time we are on the horde side, but we are still doing linen cloth. I am here with my level 90 blood elf hunter, Giannis, and he actually needs the linen cloth that I will be farming today, because his first aid, as you can see, is at a sucky level. <laughs> and just so you know, all those green items that I got on Loriana last time on the Alliance side actually sold on the Auction House. So if you're wondering and they're like, oh, what am I going to do with this? I can't use this, whatever, whatever. You can sell them. You can get a little bit of money. This can help you with that. So it's not just the uh, cloth or whatever. So, you know, and before I start, because oh, I forgot last time. Let me show you the map. We are right here, which is called the Decrepit Fields. And right across from the Splucha, or however you want to pronounce that. And this is in Silver Pine Forest in Eastern Kingdoms. We're kind of in undead territory. But whatever, it doesn't matter because we're horde. And we will be hunting down these poor innocent organs. I don't like that. <laughs> I like organs, but I also like my blood elf, so whatever. Let me get off of my mount here. And I'm going to set the stopwatch. And as, I, as of last time, I am going to be going for 10 minutes. So, here we go. Alright, guys. There's my 10 minutes. I can probably guarantee already that I didn't do as good as it did on Loriana. Yeah. I only got two stats plus an eight. And then I did get a tiger's eye, which I did used to be a jewel crafter on here, but I switched to leather working because of reasons. <laughs> and I got this buckler. Um, that's about it for the green items and the cloth. I mean, we're really focusing on the linen cloth, which was only 48, which is okay. There's still another area, just like on the Alliance, that I can show you guys. And I do want to mention that these guys are only level 12, just like the uh, gnolls were. So you could probably easily get these guys at 15, 20, whatever. And it's easier if you have like my druid that can take down a bunch at once or maybe a warrior. Anything, any class that has like an attack that can gather a bunch and take them down at once. So, And I will be right back and show you guys the next area where you can gather cloth for the horde side. Hey guys, I'm back, and we are at the second area to farm linen cloth with the horde. We're in Azara, and I really do apologize if I'm pronouncing his name wrong. I never really bothered to try to pronounce it right. But anyhow, we are farming these restless spirits down here. And they will be dropping our linen for us. And again, they are level 11, level 12. Easily done at level 15, 20. If you need the linen cloth or even like the green gear that they might drop for a little bit of money. So again, let me get off my mount. And I am going to set this for... Well, I'm going to just set my stopwatch and we are going to go for... 10 minutes and here we go. Alright guys, that was the 10 minutes for Lake Minar and Azura, Az Azarsha. <laughs> As I said, I can't pronounce and I, I don't think I mentioned it was Lake Minar before, which I'm a bad person for that, but anyhow. This was actually off of a scout, along with that, I have not done this area, so I got a quest. And I actually thought I was going to get more, but I only got a, another stack and eight. 
so it's not as good as the worgens over in silver pine forest got another green to sell so but those are your two areas and I, I thought I was going to do better because you're constantly running in a circular pattern to here, and you know, it's not like the workings are all spread out differently, but apparently the workings actually drop more, so there you have it. You know, the workings drop more over there in Silver Pride Forest in the decrepit field. And I will be using this for my first aid, which I used the first batch for, as you can see. And I will see you guys and the next episode. Bye-bye. And they, res they spawn pretty quickly. So.